All right, let's start episode two. On The Walking Dead. I'm freezing. Oh, wait. wait till we get up to Wellington, then talk to me about cold. Now I'm gonna go look for more wood. Where's the rest of your group? I I'm by myself. Bullshit. Krista, run! I'm out. Grab her. Let's go. Would someone mind telling me what the fuck is going on here? She was bit by a dog. Oh, that For pregnant all you lady. Know, she could be working with Carver. The cheating bastard. So, since you're pretty much on your own, what's your plan? I don't know. I'm kind of on my own now. Well, you're welcome to stay here if you want. Jesus, Mary, and Joseph. Think about it. You're Carver, what do you do? Who's Carver? You were in the woods with Krista. Please. Ah! <laughs> I'm fine. I'm fine. Just... just lost my footing. Damn it. God damn it. Come this way. Damn it, you get your asses over here, both of you. We have to go. You could have saved him. How Fuck could you just sake. leave him? I'm sorry. I apologize for my mistakes. I just I don't know. I didn't. Uh, <laughs> and that's the guy that has rash judgment, so he's going to be fucking pissed. Ah. Oh, mistakes were made. <laughs> Ugly bastards. This is not good. We're trapped in this food area. Use all your strength, Clementine! There we go. We still need something to block the door. I'm sorry about Pete. Whatever. I tried to apologize. Why'd you leave my uncle? Back at the stream. Why'd you follow me? Pete got bit. What? He got bit. He wasn't going to make it. I told the truth. What do we do now? I don't care. If we're stuck here, we should at least look around. Maybe we can find something to help us get out of here. Knock yourself out. Talk to me. Nick, you want to give me some help here? Are you listening to me? This is no time for this. I know I, you lost your uncle. I'm sorry. But we're going to die in here if you don't help Still, me. Still. I know what it is. The fuck you do. Okay, what then? It's for making booze. But that rig ain't fit to piss in. What, you don't believe me? I've been around some places, man. Do you man. think they'll break through that window? Guess I'll just stand here, talking to myself. Fuck. Okay. There's gotta be something in here. All this food is rotten. I said this food is rotten. Don't you ignore me, giving me the cold shoulder? Who the fuck do you think you are? I am Clementine. I am one sexy, sassy little girl, alright? 
they taught me to survive and that's exactly what I'm gonna do. You wanna sit here and fucking pity yourself? Go ahead. Fine. I'll leave your ass in here. I should have saved the other guy. Even though he was bitten and I couldn't have saved him really. What is that stuff? Let me see. Oh, now you want to help. Alcohol? Yeah. <sighs> Whiskey. Really? Now what? You're just gonna drink yourself to oh, death? fuck if I know. We wait, I guess. That door's not gonna hold out forever. Is he drunk? Stop making noise! What the fuck are you doing? Are you alright there, buddy? Stop! You got a bad attitude, you know that? Kill my mom. No. <laughs> Sounds weird when I say it out loud, huh? I had to kill Lee. Luke always used to push me. I never wanted to go into business with him. I remember when he sold me on it. His big plan. Some fucking plan. Case of beer in, he just said, Nick, we're burning daylight. And that was that. After six months, we were flat broke. I didn't care. We were having fun. I wish I was like him. I wish I could just keep moving all the time. I'm just not built like that. That's all right. Everyone I grew up with, it all happened to them. Now, it's gonna happen to us. Oh, that's positive. We're all so fucked. This whole world is fucked. We'll make it. Bullshit. Don't you try and tell me off. I'll give you some I words, mean, what's man. the point? We'll just march to some new place and somebody else will die. It's never gonna stop. Eventually, it'll be our turn. I can't believe we've been here a day. A day. It's been a day, right? You're drunk. Hey, kid. No. Have a drink with me. No, thanks. Sorry, I'm not gonna get drunk and just Listen, cry to myself. They're not coming for us. You should go. Run for it. I'm not leaving what, you behind. What are you gonna do? Stay here. I'm tired. Go find Luke and the rest. They'll take care of you. We can make it. We have to try. I don't have to do anything. Come with me. Are you kidding? And leave all this? You can't just sit here and die. Why not? What does it matter? You still have Luke and everyone else. They're family. Nick, I need your help. Please. You're right. Mm. Yeah. Just quit fucking drinking. Now look, if we get separated, cabin's only half a mile from here. You can't miss it. Yeah, but what if I go half a mile in the wrong direction? You ready? Yes, I'm ready to go. <laughs> Fuck it. I 
I see you. <laughs> sneaky, sneaky, sneaky. Why do you have the bottle still? <laughs> Fuck you, motherfucker. <laughs> this is not good. We gotta run there, buddy. Hey, over here. Come on, you fucks. Look at me. Get Don't the fuck out of here. I'm not leaving you behind. I said get the fuck out of here. Why? <laughs> dodge and weave, dodge and weave. <laughs> fuck. You better not die on me. After I save that other after I chose not to save that other guy and save you instead, you better not fucking die. Just leave the door wide open. <laughs> Clementine, are you all right? No. Luke's not with you. Where's Alvin? What happened? It's been hours. Where are they? We got attacked. By who? Walkers. Jesus. Pete got killed. I was with Nick, but. My God. Where were you? Where were you exactly? Down by the stream. We gotta go. Just hold on a minute. My husband is still out there. Get the guns. All right, let's armor up, bitches. Luke and Alvin went out looking for you. I told them not to go. Damn it, Luke. All right, the baby mama Clementine, is ready to go. Can you, can you please watch Sarah? Yes. She's upstairs. Just distract her and don't tell her anything. Just go. Hurry. You'll be safe inside. Just don't open the doors for anything. We'll be back soon. Alright, I gotta protect Sarah. I got my mission. Do I got my trusty Say hammer geez. with me? Not a good picture. I found this under the house. There was all kinds of old stuff. What were you doing under the house? <laughs> it's so cool. Take one of me. Come on, take one of me. Sure. Get me in a good pose, okay? It's good to have pictures of happy moments. Okay. What's wrong? Um, where's my dad? He'll be back. He'll be fine. Are you sure? Yes. Sorry, I, I I just need to. Is she having a panic attack? Let's think about something else. I mean, I don't have a walkie-talkie anymore, but you want to see what I found? Sure. What is it? Will you show me how to use it? I couldn't find any bullets. If something's wrong, I should know. What if I have to use one? It's too dangerous. Everything is dangerous. I need to know sometime. You should let your dad teach you. What should I shoot? Don't do that! S -s -s sorry Sorry! Maybe I could practice outside. There's that tree. Hey, Luke's back! He's back? Don't wander off by yourself. Are you sure that's Luke? Look outside. Who the fuck was that person? Was Are you sure that was Luke? Are you sure? Who the fuck?
fuck is that? That's guy? not Luke. Yeah, I didn't think so, but Clem, I think I know him. He can't see me. You have to make him go away. Go hide. Go and find somewhere to hide. Where? Oh. Clem, I can't breathe. I can't, I can't breathe. Shh. Calm down. It's okay. Maybe she has some sort Hello? of anxiety problem. Lock the door. Hello there. Who are you? Who are you? Well, actually, I'm your neighbor. Neighbor? That's right. My family and I are set up a ways down river. I'm kind of surprised we haven't run into each other yet. What's your name? What's your name? <laughs> My name is George, honey. Ignore. Pleasure to meet you. You mind if I come in for a bit? Hey, don't just push your way in here. Yes, I do mind. This is a nice place. Is there anyone else around? You don't usually see cabins this big out here. Sure could pack a lot of folks in there. Hey, you can talk to me, all right? I'm not gonna bite you. Well, I'll cut to the chase. I'm out looking for my people. Seven of them, to be exact. Oh, the people that They've are fucking dead? They've been and I'm worried they might have gotten lost. Maybe you've seen them. A couple of farm boys and an old man. Spanish guy and his daughter. Quiet girl, a bit taller than you. Big black guy, this big, and a pretty little pregnant lady. That's a lot of people to lose. Tell me about it. This whole damn thing's a pain in the ass. Shit. He is no bueno. I gotta get him the fuck out of this house. Why is he looking for them? A lot of plates for one person. Looks like a tornado ran through here. I don't ever do the dishes. Hey, well, believe me, I don't either. Just passing through or you been here a while? Hey, listen, kid. I hope you're not one of those nuts headed up north looking for Shangri-La. Now, I'm not sure why you'd go anywhere after finding this place. Been here for a year. Is that right? It's dangerous to stay put that long. Surprise you've lasted. You must be pretty tough. I've been lucky. I doubt that. Where does this go? Uh, in the drawer there. That's right, you put that fucking knife down. Get the fuck out of my house, man. You have no room to be in here. Well, it's a real nice place. Kind of cozy. Well, it's my place, so move the fuck on. I knew a guy that always wore shirts like this. Doctor. Real smug, son of a bitch. But a smart man. I don't care. You know, you're really not very polite for a little girl. And you're not very polite for an adult. This is my house. Fair point. <laughs> well, well. White's in trouble. Three moves away from checkmate. What was that? I thought you said nobody's here. It's probably just the wind. Hey, buddy! Who do you think you are pulling out a gun in my fucking house? I need to do something about him. No, 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 no. I need to do something about him. She's 
under the bed. I told you, nobody's here. Seems that way. Didn't mean to be rude. Well, Couldn't good. just leave you here with a good conscience if someone was poking around, right? Sure. He gets Who's me. this? Must be someone who lived here. Must be. I don't like you, you poking around. You have no around. idea who these people are, do you? I don't know what you're talking about. Let me ask you this. When you met them, how much did they trust you? I'm not telling you shit. Just get the fuck out. Nobody wants you here. Well, I think I've troubled you long enough. I can let myself out. Thanks. Don't come back. You have a real good day now. Where is he? He's gone. What if he comes back? Who is he? Why is he here looking for you guys? Is that the guy that you guys were t that other guy was talking about before? The one that's been we need to find the, the others. We can't go outside. Clementine, Sarah, you were with Nick, right? We gotta go find him. A man was here. What? What did she say? Someone came to the cabin. What? Clementine talked to him. And you just opened the door for him? Calm down, Rebecca. Calm down. I am calm. You calm down. I didn't open the door. He just came in. She's telling the truth. Did he say his name? Did he say what his name was? Maybe it wasn't him. You know damn well who it was. He said his name was George. George? That's what he said. Look, Clem, just tell us what he looked like. What was he wearing? Did he sound different? How old was he? He had a big brown coat. Did it have a lining? A collar? Yeah, fur. He talked about you, Dad. You're not gonna hurt anyone, are you? Of course he won't, Sarah. Uh, your dad's the nicest man I know, which is why he's not gonna do anything crazy or not nice, right? You know these are bad people, sweetie. They will do or say anything to hurt us. All right, what do you think? Did it seem like he'd be coming back? He saw a picture of me. A picture? What were you doing taking pictures? Carlos. What? You need to calm down. All right, you're scaring your daughter. You told me to distract her. Distract? Sarah. So I'm just an idiot? I thought we were friends. I was just he was doing... scouting. We got lucky. He wasn't expecting to find us. Clementine must have surprised him. She hadn't been there. Well, he was too smart to stick around, but he'll be back with the rest. We don't have much time. He's right. Everyone pack up. We're moving now. Alvin, wait! We have to leave now, sweetie, before he comes back with more bad guys. But it's gonna be okay. Let's just go get your things. What does he want? To bring us back. Clem, I don't know what he told you, but William Carver is a dangerous man. He's the leader of a camp not far from here, and he's very smart. We were lucky to escape. What did he do to Look, you guys? I'm sorry to involve you, but now that he's seen you, you'll be safer with us. We have to leave. Hmm. Look, we gotta find Nick on our way out of here. You know where he was, right? Yeah. Alright. Everybody grab your stuff. Let's hit the road. <laughs> 